One of the latest developments in light aeroplane building in the States is the pneumatic rubber pontoon. These rubber floats are the invention of Captain Ashley McKinley, veteran of the Bird South Pole Expedition. When they're fully inflated, they weigh only about 40 pounds each, and they're built for ice or water. Only the underside is rigid, and it's claimed that they can take much more battering than skis or the ordinary floats. At Long Island, the new pontoons are being shown off for the first time. In effect, they convert a land machine into an ice or seaplane. Like a dirigible, each pontoon is divided into compartments, so that any damage to one would not mean the floats collapse. They are rounded to give them increased buoyancy and easy steering with the rudder alone. So aeroplane construction takes another step forward, a smooth gliding movement that makes small machines safer and more useful all the year round.